You have a busy lifestyle, and who has time to go to the mall and fight the crowds on the weekend? But yet you want to look your best. Well, today you're going to meet the guy that makes it happen by bringing it all to you. I'm Daniel M. This is Front Row. So as promised, we're going to meet Carmen Bucco of Bucco Couture. Carmen, say hello to our audience. Hi, how are you? Dan, thank you so much for having me. I I'm so it. glad that you're here. I, I, I think you just have such a great story to tell. I'm so excited about all the things that you do, um, helping guys look a little bit better, but most importantly, for the guy who just can't get to the store or just doesn't want to, you're his guy. So tell me a little bit how you began with this. You know, we were, we were really working out of the back of our cars as consultants, going to clients' houses, bringing up a suitcase, and showing the materials. Mm -hmm. um, and I've been doing it for 14 years. And I'm always an out of box thinker. So I said, how can I, number one, generate more revenue? It's important for a small business. Sure. So I said, I really need something that's gonna speak to the people and drive traffic. So um, it's funny that you say drive traffic because technically, right? one of the great things that people are gonna get to see later is this incredible van that you have that's a mobile store, but yes. so you put all this together. So we put it all together. Uh, it happened early October, and everybody said, ah, what are you doing? Well, you're putting a, a store on a truck? How crazy is that? I said, but that's what I want to do. So, um, so I went looking for a truck, and I'm like, do I get a sandwich truck, or do I get something sleek and, and unique? So I wound up uh, at Mercedes, and on the whim, uh, I bought a Mercedes Sprinter. <clears throat> Now I needed to find somebody to outfit the truck. Well, that was a task in itself. And I knew my launch date had to be before the holidays because we needed people. Of course, yeah. So I went into my local pizzeria, told them what I was doing. I loved the work that they did in their pizzeria. I hired their cousin. I said, you got one month to get it done. So uh, you'll see later on the inside of the truck. Well, one um, of the things that I, I, I was amazed by it is that I, I felt like not only was I in a shop, but I was also perhaps even in my own home. You know, you've got this lovely cabinetry and everything. But so let's talk a little bit about the van. Okay. okay. Um, you, you you open up the doors, That's and it. the first thing I'm hit with is is here's all of my accessories left and right. I mean, the first thing I see is there's belts, there's pocket squares. To my right, there's cufflinks and tie bars. Okay. So so you really wanted to bring an entire experience on Absolutely. wheels to someone's home. Listen, everybody. Um Guys who are very busy and successful and wear nice clothing, they want to be treated right. So, so how do you do that without having them to have to go to the store? Guys don't have the time. Sure. And, and it cuts into their hourly rate. And Think in the weekends, it. it's, it's, it's a madhouse. So you, you take the excuse away from them that they can just throw on that sloppy suit. Exactly. And put on something nice by bringing it to them. So, Absolutely. So now you, you come through and you see that you've got all this, all this other merchandise. So, um, you know, what, what was, I mean, do you switch around during the seasons? We do. do you? We do. We, we like to keep a fresh inventory. Uh, I think that's very important. Uh, ties become emotional buys. So uh, it's, a, it's a challenge to kind of get guys to buy ties because it is. It's an emotional attachment to a, to a person. So we keep rotating that. But we ask our clients, what, are their, what's, what, do they, what do they desire? What are they looking for? Right. So that helps us on our buys. Okay, so you've got that. And then you've got all the, the peripheral things. You know, it's yes. I noticed you have shoes. Yes. So, so I can pick up a belt and a shoe. And now I can pick up a shirt. You have casual wear. You yep. also carry jeans. Yep. Okay. And so we do a we do a full line of jeans. Right. Uh, we do a fancier jean, but we also do a custom jean. Okay. People hate buying jeans. It's the worst thing they can do. They never fit in them. We refine their jean that they already have and make it better. That's that's <coughs> awesome. So so now we we come around the other side. I know that there's a lot of merchandise, and, and you've got your suits, and you've got stuff in a variety of sizes. Yes. Yes. Okay. We carry every size. Um, and we mainly use that for fitter lines because most guys are educated now, so they want custom. Right. So that actually helps me refine their fit better. Okay. So if I'm in a hurry, um, I can pick out an outfit pretty much. You may have my size on hand or, or 
Absolutely. you're able to get it for me within a reasonable amount of time, and then yet still have something perhaps fitted for me if I want to go that extra bit. Exactly. That's exactly. great. That's yes. that's awesome. And now you have you have shirts. We have shirts. You had cologne. I yes. saw. Yes. <laughs> Two of my favorites were on the shelf. Barbados so, and Gucci. They're yeah, great. I noticed they're immediately. Um, it was really really nice and everything, and even the little you know the little adornments that yes. you've got too. The 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 cufflinks that. Guys want to accessorize. We right. don't get anything as guys to right. accessorize and, and, and make the garment look more appealing and not just a uniform. So now you normally, you work by appointment. By appointment only. Okay, so someone, and, and how do people learn about you? Is it word of mouth? Are you finding you have a huge word of mouth? Very quickly, um, I started the business in a one, in a 12 by, in a, in a one bedroom apartment. I moved my bedroom into my living room and my office into my bedroom. Okay. Three years later, I had 348 clients with all word of mouth. Wow. So I truly believe that that's the concept and that's the way this business works. It's getting out there and speaking to the people who, who want this type of service. You know, I often say that um, guys really don't understand fashion a lot of times and they just want to look like their friends and who says that their friends look good anyway? But when you have a friend that does look good and they, and they turn you on to someone like yourself and then find out that I don't even really have to do any work to look like this. No. This guy is just going to come to me. That's such a home run for a guy. Um, well, we're going to make it even easier. Coming down the road, I'm working on a software system where once I have your pattern, you can actually put fabric, shirts, and ties together and see what a complete outfit looks like and buy it right there. Wow. Because I already have your pattern. That's, that's amazing. Now, you started out a little bit in that area, right? You were originally... In, in a tailoring. You were I was. I, I learned how to tailor. I, like, I first started learning how to shine shoes. And then I learned about tailoring. I learned about the wools because that's really the most important people don't realize is the material that they're buying. Um, so I learned about that. And I got tired of retail with all the broken promises. And uh, I met a guy who was in this type of business and it's something I've always wanted to do. I wanted to take care of customers, sure. truly take care of customers. <laughs> And uh, I started there, and they started to get that corporate type attitude. I ran away uh, and started on my own, and I, I love it. I love well, it. you truly do take care of your customer if you're bringing the entire shop to them. Absolutely. Um, and again, you guys are going to see this uh, in a bit. It's really amazing. You're, you're going to love it. But so now, so that you've got a tailoring background, mm -hmm. you started shining suits, which I love that story. You know, I remember as a little boy, my dad you know, coming to this country and shine shoes as a young man, you know. So um, a work ethic that really is strong yes. and, and it makes a big difference in learning how to uh, work customer service. Correct. You know, and, and take care of the people around you. You've got these vans. Now, what areas are you in now? So we're very excited. We just launched another consultant out in Connecticut and the White Plains area in New York. Uh, we're now in South Carolina, Atlanta, Philadelphia, and I handle New Jersey and Manhattan. Wow. That's great, and you're growing, and, and we're we're very excited about the growth. Um, you know, a lot of things are going mobile, and yeah. uh, a lot of guys are busy. They don't want to leave their office. Yeah. They don't want to be bothered. They want they want to, they want that holding hand. You know, and they want somebody. We be, we truly believe in let you worry about your work, life, and home. Let us take care of your clothes. That's that's a great philosophy. It's a great model too. So the the average appointment, how long does it take? Let's so, say I was going to take my son, you know, I really have no time during the week. I don't want you to come to my office. I'm really busy. Um, come to my home on a Saturday afternoon. You know, what, what kind of time are we spending together? Probably about an hour. An we hour. Tra we train our, we tra I, tra I personally train my consultants. Okay. Um, because we truly believe in fit. But uh, aside from that, um, our goal is to ask the right questions. A lot of people forget to ask the right questions. Yes. And once you have those questions lined up, the, it's easy part from there. It's what do you have, what do you need, what do you want to add? Sure. I, even on the weekends, I want you to stay home and worry about, have fun with your kids, have fun with your wife, have fun with your family, whoever it is. Sure. Um, There's my hangover. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so that's great. An hour. Just that's it. an hour. I can spend an hour with you, and then you're going to give me some choices and some options. That's and then it. from there, we're constantly in touch with one another, I assume. I stay in touch with my clients via newsletters. Okay. Um, I call them once in a while. Um, I let them do their thing. If something comes in, right. and I feel that it's worth it for them, because we'll do a whole wardrobe evaluation. We want to know what's in your closet. because sure. and, and our virtual closet actually allows you to do that. You can actually put a garment up and delete it. Okay, that's great. Um, once you delete it, I get notified. So I can call you up and say, hey, why did you get rid of that suit? Was there a problem? Let's replace it with A, B, and C. Right. 
you know, that's great. Well, that makes it so much easier for, for me as a guy, because um, half the times I don't even know what I have, you know, and I'm, I'm working in the front half of my closet. Well, and guys don't even know how many suits they're supposed to have in their closet. Yeah, well, you know, that always amazes me, um, and shoes. Yes, yes. <laughs> I'm often told that I'm not the usual guy with 56 pairs of shoes, but uh, I like a variety. I like a little bit of a choice. What's wrong with having five pairs of shoes? I, well, I like having five <laughs> pairs of shoes, but but I fifty six is just gives me a little more options for myself. You got a big closet. <laughs> I do have a big closet, but you know, and I, and I enjoy the experience. And when I right. meet people like yourself, I love the experience of of finding new things. What what stuff looks great? What's new? What's hot? The different uh, styles, the different cuts. One of the things I noticed when we were outside before is this little. In the back of your suit, you have yes. this little strap. Tell us about that. So, so a lot of guys like it, and a lot of guys hate it. The, okay. You know, everybody's not proportioned properly. So, a lot of people like the side vent look. Right. Uh, the strap is there to hold the two sides in, so it's not. So the jacket so it doesn't always spread lies out. properly. Right. See, now I have never had that in a suit, and the minute I spotted it on yours, I was like, "This is perfect," because I am proportioned a little. A little bigger in certain areas, and I like something that's going to keep my jacket looking just perfect at all times. So, uh, and, well, the, and that's a custom feature. It's correct? a custom feature. Well, you could do it in a ready-made, but <clears throat> again, something that people forget. Again, it's attention to detail. Uh, you'll have that vent strap, and as you're walking, though, it's really windy. All of a sudden, your back tail goes into that inside that vent strap. We actually put a little belt loop in the center of the jacket, so it all stays in line. Wow. And your that's, flap doesn't go. That's <clears throat> detail. Yeah. That is detail. So it's, it's the little things that, you know, a lot of people forget that we, we really try and focus on. Okay, so now the custom. So we find some ready-made stuff for me and I'm, I'm all ready to go. I'm set for now, but I want to order a couple of things and I want a, a couple of things made just for me or whatever. What's, you know, what's that experience like? How long does that take? It's the same, an hour. It's, it's really not okay. difficult. When we get, it, it, it's, it's a process. So when we get the fabrics that you, first of all, I'm, I'm going to know what's in your wardrobe because I've already gone over that with you. Which this I love. A, this is about education. It's not just about selling clothes. It's yeah. about knowing who your client is, knowing their lifestyle. We dress you for your lifestyle. And we don't want you to be uniformed. So, I mean, we have linings from London that are really gorgeous, that, you know, really step out of the box. 99% um, of my customers actually have me dress them. So That's once amazing. I finish with you the That's first amazing. time, 99% of the time, you're, I'm dictating what you're going to wear. Uh, that's so exciting. You know, uh, I, I can't wait any longer. We need to take the audience outside <laughs> and show them this amazing van and this this incredible experience that you've created that I'm I really so excited hope everybody about. Everybody loves it. I, I really think do. you guys are going to like it. We're going to be back in just one second with Buco Custom Couture. Mm -hmm. Now we're inside this mobile men's store. It is just unbelievable. Carmen, walk me through. Like The first thing I spot when I walk in is like you've got every accessory, the pocket squares, which I love, the belts, the socks, everything. So let's walk through. Give me a tour of this. So really, we've, we've come up with a way to get the client to really focus on not having to go to the store. So we wanted to add all the little bells and whistles, the pocket squares, the socks. We do custom jeans, uh, belts. And then yeah, we, I, I see we have this whole jeans and shirts and, I mean, shoes? Shoes, everything. We carry everything. Even we carry uh, shaving, art of shaving, uh, different types of colognes as well, uh, various Amazing. shirts. We're very excited. Uh, box shirts. Some guys don't have time for custom. So it gives them the opportunity to come in, try something on, and be able to walk away with it. It's great. So you get a little immediate gratification, and then at the same time, you can order your stuff for the future. Exactly. Now, I, the first thing I noticed when you open the doors is this cabinetry. I mean, this whole thing is custom made. We, we wanted our clients to have the look and feel as if they were walking into a boutique. And it's a little small, but they still get, they still get that feel. It's a one-on-one -on -one service. Uh, we truly believe in unparalleled service when it comes to that. 
So it, it gives them a, a nice feel. Well, I, I'm impressed because you really have everything from soup to nuts. I mean, I Thank say, you. We've got suspenders up here, and then we come back in here. You've got a coffee machine. You're going to serve do. coffee. Yes. And a refrigerator. We actually, it's amazing. you know, we, we want, again, we wanted that feel, like right. you're, you're in a boutique. So we actually offer our clients a glass of Pellegrino or coffee. That's amazing. It, gets, it makes them feel more comfortable. Beautiful, um, beautiful coat. Beautiful scarves. Thank you. An entire rack of ties. I could just take this off the wall and bring it home with me right sure, now. Absolutely. You know, it's got everything that I could possibly want. Jackets. And then here's all the suits. And we've we've put some ready-made product in here. Most of our business is custom. Right. We wanted, again, that instant gratification. You need something, you need to go. Uh, we carry sport coats as well as suits, slacks, some sports casual, cotton See pants, shirts. shirts. Cufflinks, tie bars, suspenders, ties, Pellegrino. It doesn't get any better than it does. this. We love you it. You did an awesome job Thank with you. this. I Just love so you this. know, we also have a, a full length mirror. Right, your and dressing a room. room. That's yeah. incredible. Yeah. And this pulls up in front of my office. That's it. That's amazing. It. It's Absolutely as simple amazing. Simple as that. One, two, three. Well, I, I love it. Thank you so much for Thank having you. us today awesome. to share your vision, and it's really great. I love Beautiful. it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I want to thank Carmen Bucco for joining us today and sharing his extraordinary vision. I'm Daniel M. for Front Row, and remember, life's too short to view from a distance.